Well, welcome. Welcome. I am so excited. My name is Pastor Pete. I'm glad you could join us. Today is our first edition of Kids Corner. Uh, we have been very slacking on doing a, a children's message, so I apologize for that. But this one is geared specifically towards the kids. Um, yeah, so I'm so glad that you are tuning in. Now, you're wondering, why am I standing next to the baptism? This is our baptismal font. And why are there candles here? Why are there can lit candles on top of the baptismal font? That's, you know, it would be really hard to baptize somebody right now. Well, well we are remembering our baptism that God loves us, that God calls us as his children. And that it, in the end, that baptism, it, 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 it unlocks a wonderful gift for us. That when our time has come, when our time is up, we get to go see Jesus. We get to go see our family members that have gone before us. How many of you have had a, a close family member pass away? Now, I know some of you might be a bit young for that. I, my, grand, my first grandfather, well, my, I, my first funeral, I was 12 years old. That's when I went uh, for my grand, when my grandfather passed away. That was the first funeral I'd ever been to. Wasn't quite sure what was going on or whatnot, but um, today is All Saints Day. We are celebrating the, the saints that go before us, that when people pass away, they, be, they become saints. Some people like to say, well, they're angels. No, they're, they're saints. That they are called, they're part of God's um, wonderful family up there. And so we light a candle to remember them. That's why we have these candles lit. Um, the candles remind us of the light, the light of Christ and the promise that God gives to us. That's why we are doing that. Um, have you seen the movie Coco? That's kind of what All Saints is. Well, in fact, that's... You know, uh, Dios de, de Muertos, that's, that's, the, uh, that, that's the, uh, the, the Hispanic way of remembering their, their dead. Where they take the candle, and, or they, where they put up this, the shrine, they put up the pictures of their loved ones. Um, for us, yeah, some of us may have pictures of our loved ones, but there's that, that special day where um, they put up their, their pictures, and then that means their dead relatives get to come and see them on earth. They may not be able to see them, but their relatives get to come and see them. So it's kind of cool. Um, it's, a, it's a cute movie. And so they, but that is all about remembering their past, um, the, their loved ones, their family members that have gone on before them. Sometimes we may not even remember them, uh, but they remember us as well. So um, yeah, so that's why, we, that's why today we light candles in remembrance, in remembrance to remember our loved ones, our family members. So thank you so much for joining us. And then I want to leave you with a, a quick little, uh, we, we're going to do a, a table grace. Something that you can do with your family members. Do, how many of you pray before a meal? Now, be honest, remember, Jesus is watching you. No, I'm kidding. Uh, well, Jesus is watching you, but um, yeah, we, we pray to God. We thank God for the food that we receive. We ask that, it, uh, that it, we thank him for our blessings. And we also ask that the food will bless us and nourish us and to help keep us strong and healthy and safe and alive and so that we can be good, good children, good disciples of God and of Jesus. So when I worked at Bible camp, we did all kinds of goofy ones. You know, how many of you do the, the Come Lord Jesus Be Our Guest? That's the one that I grew up with. Um, there's also my little brother learned it at daycare. It was just simply, thank you, Jesus, for this food. Amen. And then the, the, his daycare provider, Mary, would always say, good kids. And so my brother would, you know, that's, that was the, thank you, Jesus, for this food. Amen, good kids. So we'll start off with a simple one for this week. So I invite you now this week when you, when you sit down for a meal uh, to remind your parents, hey, we got we to thank Jesus for this food. So thank you, Jesus, for this food. Amen. And I hope you have a great week. And we'll see you next time. Peace.